anger over body camera video. The family says officials only showed them 20 seconds of the video. They're demanding more and the Elizabeth City City Council has petitioned for the release of the video. But North Carolina law complicates things and Sparaco spoke to lawmakers trying to change that. Following the release of only 20 seconds of body camera footage of what happened the day Andrew Brown Jr. was shot and killed by a Pasquotank Sheriff deputy, North Carolina state senators are pushing for their latest proposal of a bill that could change the course of how videos are released. Everyone recognized that there was a need to do something. State Senator Ben Clark is one of the sponsors of the North Carolina bill, which would require police body and dash camera footage to be released upon request 48 hours following an incident. He says they pushed for changes to the bill recently following the cases of George Floyd and Micaiah Bryant. Why is it that the state of Ohio can release a video in a matter of hours, whereas North Carolina, we're a week into this and we've seen nothing. North Carolina state law currently only allows a judge to rule whether a video is to be released if a petition is filed. After Andrew Brown Jr.'s family and attorneys were only allowed to see a small portion of the video recorded on the day of the shooting. The video will be seen by the public and we will get justice. Senator Clark says he hopes this bill will change how transparency plays a role in these cases. I don't believe our law enforcement agencies run around trying to hide things, but you give that impression by not supporting a concept that provides for full transparency. If we had Senate Bill 510 in effect now, the, the family would already have the video. Clark says the bill is currently sitting with the rules committee. If the bill doesn't move forward soon, he says changes to body camera requirements could be introduced in other justice reform bills. In Elizabeth City and Sparaco for 13 News Now. And the bill will give law, give law enforcement the right to challenge the request in court if the video presents confidential or sensitive information.